Hi everyone, this is Imran. Today in this video training, I'll be showing you how you can create a mega menu in your WordPress website for free. To do this job, I'll use Elementor Page Builder and Elements Kit Elementor add-ons. And I'll use the free version of both plugins so you won't have to spend any money. Okay friends, let me show you the demo mega menu that I'll create. Here you can see I have a header with menu items and once I hover over here, here you can see a big section and using this big section, you can display a lot of content to your visitors. That's the main purpose of mega menu. And if I hover over about us, here you can see the team members. If I hover over pricing, here goes the pricing section and blog items. Well friends, I will do this task in three basic steps. Firstly, I will install this plugin Elements Kit. Secondly, I will enable basic settings of Elements Kit. And finally, I will create and design the mega menu section like this. So, let's get to be started. Here, I'm on the dashboard of my WordPress website. And let's start with the first step. Install the plugin. Here, I have navigate to plugins and click on add new. On the right top, here goes search plugin option. I'm going to search for elements kit. And here is the expected plugin. To install this plugin, I'm going to click install now button. Click activate. And you can see elements kit plugin is installed and activated. At the same time, on the left here you can see a new menu item, Elements Kit. If I click on here on Elements Kit, it will send you to the dashboard of this plugin. Ok friends, let's scroll down and here goes all the information regarding this plugin and click on Elements, here goes the Elements and click on Module. And now you will have to remember an important note. To create a mega menu like this, you will have to enable header and footer module and mega menu module. Okay, so make sure these modules are activated. Okay, friends, now I have successfully completed step number one, installed the plugin and showed the basic setting of Elements Kit. Now let's move on to the final step create mega menu. Create a mega menu using Elements Kit Elementor add-on plugin, you will have to create a header template using this add-on plugin. To create a header template, just go to header and footer and from here you can create header template. But I'm not going to show you how you can create a header template. I have already created a video and I'll provide the link and here goes it. How you can create a custom header and footer template using Elementor and Elements Kit add-on. Okay, but it's pretty simple. Click on add new and here you will type the name of the header template and type header, condition entire site, click activate and hit save changes. And you will see something like this and click edit. Okay, hit edit content and you will be able to easily create header template. Okay, so creating a header template is a must to display a mega menu like this using Elements Kit. Okay, so now go to the menu system of WordPress. To get the menu system, you will have to go to appearance and go to menu or menus. Just click on menus and here goes the interface to create menu in WordPress. If you are very beginner and don't know how to create a menu and add items to menu just like this, I have already created a video on how to create a navigation menu in WordPress and customize WordPress menu. Okay, you will get the link in the description. Don't forget to check it. And now start designing the mega menu. Okay, if I visit the site, here you can see basic menu, it shows nothing. Remember, 
and it will look like this after a few minutes. Very fantastic. Okay, firstly, you will have to enable. Here you can see Elements Kit, Mega Menu, and check this box to enable this menu for Mega Menu content. And hit Save Menu. And now, if you hover over here on the items, then you will see Mega Menu button. So, let's start with Home Menu to start with this just click on this blue button and you will see this interface firstly you will have to enable the mega menu now it is green and you will have to click here this big button edit mega menu content here you will see the elementor page builder interface okay friends here we have two options you can design a block from the scratch or yourself like this and second option you can use pre-built section or blocks that comes with elements kit okay and to save the time of this tutorial i'm going to use the pre-built section or block okay so here you can see ek button just if i click on it here you will see all the available sections or block okay if i click on header and go to mega menu content i'm going to scroll down and here goes the option that comes with free version just click on here and here goes the content and you can change each and every content you can change color you can add any content if you have any working experience with Elementor page builder okay so that's it and hit update and here you can see close button I'm going to click on it I'm going to hit save and hit close button hit save menu okay I'm super excited to see the change but I did not refresh this page just click here to refresh this page and now here you can see here it is okay let's go to about us again go to the menu system and click on about us click mega menu and again enable it and edit mega menu content and once again, I'm going to use pre-built template. Just click here. Go to sections. And I'm going to select team. Where is team? Here it is. Click on it. And here goes it. Just click insert. Okay. You can change image, text, social media icons, everything. Okay. So just hit update click on close sign and friends I have already added content and here you can see icon badge and setting options just the default mega menu width should be full width and mega menu position is default hit save and click on the plus sign hit save menu and I'm not going to show you every time just go to pricing and again enable it just click mega menu content i'm going to click here to use the pre-built template go to sections and search for pricing here it is and i'm going to click insert and here goes it and i'm going to hit update and click on the plus sign and if you want you can change the settings but i'm happy with the default settings just click save click close hit save menu now it's time to refresh this page and see about us see pricing okay here you don't see the background image uh, if you face any issue 
then you will have to get back to the item just click on here edit content and here you can see edit section just click on it and go to a style and add white or any background color i'm going to add white color the code for white color is triple f and hit update again close this save item save menu and if i refresh this page this time here it is you can change or select any color okay so let's go to the block section i would like to show the block post like this again go to the menu system and click over here on menu and enable enable it and edit mega menu content okay friends i have used the default block template but this time i'm going to create from scratch okay to create a section or block you will have to click on this plus sign i'm going to create a one row section here it is and edit section mm, go to a style and add a background color i would like to add white background color if you don't add background color then this section will be transparent hit update and if i click on this plus sign here you will see the widgets search option i'm going to search for block widget and here goes block post just grab it drag and drop here okay under content here you can see layout style i'm going to select um, grid with thumb this one okay and here you can manage the featured image size the number of post and if you would like to show the title or not okay you can hide the content or show the title anything if you have a little working experience with elementor page builder i guarantee you will find it super easy okay go to the query setting and here you can see number of posts you would like to show six but number four is perfect okay fine and friend here you will see a lot of setting options okay so once you are happy click on update and once updated click on this plus sign and from here you can manage the width and go to save just click on save click plus sign and hit save menu okay this is amazing just refresh this page if i go to f block and here you can see something like that but on the demo i had something like that don't worry you can customize it just go to mega menu edit mega menu content and click on this pencil icon okay so you can show content now it will look similar to that one and go to a style and here you can see wrapper background type add any background color i'm going to add white background color okay and for content i'm going to add color black color now hit update close this button hit update hit save menu and if i refresh here now it looks similar to the demo okay friends i believe you enjoyed this video and you could create a mega menu in your wordpress website 
and don't forget to like this video to inspire me and subscribe to my channel and leave your opinion in the comment section. I would like to see you again in a new video. Thank you for watching.